Hey y'all. Um, um, so we're in Phoenix now. Venetia's taking me to the airport. I told us to get up early with her to drop off the kids and keep going, but I couldn't get up. <laughs> but she and I was gonna take a Try not to lift <laughs> to the airport, but she was like, she'll get me there instead. So it is now 7:53. My flight is at 9:04, and I have to go through customs and all that type of stuff. <laughs> Look at her shaking her head. <laughs> She'll be in Phoenix. <laughs> Hopefully it's not deep. I don't know. Kind of. And no, I didn't go to bed late last night. None of us did. I want to say we always in bed by like at least nine, almost ten. Maybe I just don't want to leave. Maybe that's what it is. I don't want to leave. Alright, y'all. I'll hit y'all back and let y'all know if I made it. <laughs> Cause it oh, because it is like a 20, 20 something minute drive from her house to the airport. So that gives me like 30 minutes to check in, do all that type of stuff and get my behind to my plane. And hopefully it's not a long behind way to the terminal. fix my braid like she was supposed to. Oh shit. So <laughs> we gotta get a lighter. You wanna start with the gas station? Nope. <laughs> when I stop, when I get to my next destination, I'm gonna try by myself. If my hair go <laughs> like that and it's gone, we gonna blame her. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Alright y'all, so I am in Houston now. I have a three hour layover. Just left Phoenix. A three hour layover. Now I get back on a plane, it's gonna be like five something when we depart. And uh, it's only a two hour trip. These layovers be good. But Houston got a really nice airport. It's big, it's clean. I like it. I like nice airports. So this three hour wait won't be so horrible. They got like Chick-fil-A and stuff. If I eat, well, all I really want to do is go to Chick-fil-A and get me an extra large device. I'll probably do it before I get on the plane. <laughs> So I'm here y'all, I made it to my destination. I am in Costa Rica. <laughs> what in the world? Yeah, I'm in Costa Rica now, y'all. So, hey, I'm at the hotel, I'm, I'm not at the hotel yet. I am still um, trying to, 
I had to charge my phone up some because we're on like 1%. So I'm trying to charge my phone up to make sure I have battery while I'm riding around with other people. Basically, you know, safety first. They got some pretty art in here though. something behind me that's cool that's cool but yeah i am in costa rica now y'all oh my focus i'm in costa rica now it is Eight fifty two out here right now. I think we're like I don't know, maybe four hours ahead. I'm back on? I don't know. I gotta check and find out. But yeah, we're here. Well not we're I'm here. <laughs> Met somebody really cool on the plane too. He owned a couple of restaurants. He's American. Owned a couple of restaurants out here and everything. I'm gonna go to one of his restaurants. He was just telling me about different things to go do and see and all that type of stuff. So that's like hot. So he was like, "Oh yeah, 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 that's cool." He's like, "If you can go over here, do this, do that, do that." And I wrote it all down, and he gave me a tattoo artist that's official out here, name and stuff. So that's cool too. All right, y'all. I will hit y'all back when I get back in the room. Not back in the room. When I get into my room. <laughs> All right, y'all. I made it to my hotel in Costa Rica. It is called Studio Hotel Boutique. This is my door. Let's see. Well, I just walked in the room. We want to see what this room looks like again together. It's one of those type of rooms that you gotta keep your card in to keep power going, which is pretty cool. I like those. Here goes my bathroom. Yes, I look a mess. The layovers be getting me. Ooh, here's the shower. Nice. You know, we got the toilet, the toilet, the toilet. Here we go. Nothing major, but it's actually like a. This hotel is actually like a 4.5 or something like that. 4.3, 4.5. It was really nice. And I didn't get here till night, so we. You know, like a restaurant up there that closes at 10 though close at 10 it's up that way can y'all see it there we go but we'll look around and walk around and do some sightseeing tomorrow but yeah i just wanted to let y'all know mm, roll that back let y'all know it's systematic in safe um my piece of hair back here, Benicia didn't fix. It's still messed up. But I am in Costa Rica now. That dance wasn't good enough, huh? I tried. <laughs> but yeah, I'm in Costa Rica. Alright, love y'all all. And I will catch up with y'all tomorrow tomorrow i love you tomorrow it's only a day dun, 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 way. love you all Hey y'all, so as y'all know, I am in Costa Rica. Yes, I am still in the bed. I woke up this morning with a headache that's going 100 miles per hour. Um, <clears throat> but I'm hoping to get up soon. I mean, I got up, brushed my teeth, and things like that. But then I always lay back down. 
my head is just hurting um but yeah hoping to get up soon and go to at least walk the streets a little bit probably go to one of these restaurants and then for dinner i probably will do um room service see what they got see see what they talking about right <laughs> Because if I do room service now, I might not walk out the door at all. I'd be too tired. You have to eat the food. So, But yeah, I am here. I am in Costa Rica. Right now, I am in the part of Santana. Santana, Santana, Santana. I don't think I'm saying it right. But um, that's where I'm at. And then I actually check out tomorrow. Ow. And go to a different destination in Costa Rica. Y'all know me. I like to jump around. Because one thing about it that I have learned. That in different countries. Like. Culture is different. Like when you go around the culture. When you go around the country and I stay in one place. Like culture is so different. You might end up more in a country part. Or you might end up more of like a city part. Like I'm downtown right now. Or you might end up like, you know, in the valleys, in the, you know. But I know my next couple of places, I think it's all by beaches. So, yeah. And and don't worry. They don't have hurricanes. They are actually above the hurricane line. But they do get, they do get monsoons. <laughs> <coughs> Y'all don't find that funny, but I do. They do get monsoons. And... They get earthquakes, and they have active volcanoes here, which I can't I can't wait to go to one because I'm going to one. They're probably like, yeah, right. Y'all watch and see. <laughs> I just got off the phone with one of my um fake boyfriends. When he see this video, he's going to laugh. Yeah, my fake boyfriend. Y'all know I ain't got no boyfriends. Y'all know I'm solo. Solo dolo. I ain't got no man running after me. But um that's why I solo travel. And I ain't why I solo travel. I solo travel for other reasons, but yes, I am still single. Still single. And I'm not mad about it. People aren't consistent these days. But anyway, let's get back to Costa Rica. I am at Costa Rica. I will hit y'all up again very soon. Let y'all know if I made it out this door or where I went to go eat or what I'm eating for tonight or what, you know. But, oh, that's so funny. I think it's so funny I got a little brag. When I was a little girl, y'all, the only piercing I used to want was that Tyrese piercing, that little brag. I wanted it so bad. I was like, yo, I want that. I want that. I was like, man, my parents would never let me have that. And I was scared. But after getting two, four. Well, these aren't really pierced. These are stretching because I've, I've been pierced as a baby. But even the stretching, you know, still. When I say two, four. Six, eight, nine. I was like, what is there to be afraid of? So I went and got a little brain now. That's 10. And my dermal, that's 11. <laughs> Don't judge me. And I'm getting tattoos out here. I was supposed to do it in Arizona with Nisha, but time took over, so we didn't get a chance to. But um, if anything, Afropunk. <laughs> oh no, and I won't get my tears. My um, not my tears. My tongue pierced. So don't. I'm like, is that the next one? No, it ain't. I don't. I don't like tongue piercings. I don't. That's where everybody else. I don't. I don't like them. 
I don't even want a man with one. <laughs> but, and that's my own reason. I have my reasons, and I'm not going to say why my reasons are, because some people might get offended. But no, I don't do tongue piercings, no. But okay. And no, I never had one. I know I still got my tongue. It looked like I have a cut or an indent. That's actually from when I was younger, and I bit my tongue hard as hell eating. That's where my picky ass get. <laughs> All right. I love you. Aw. Oh.